welcome back to my channel. This is a vlog style the channel now. So, uh, pardon the uh, stuff when I fumble through things. I'm just trying this. <laughs> anyway, I thought I would uh, take you along on our journey with us uh, today. Uh, hubby broke his right wrist and today is Monday, June 20th and we are headed to the hospital to get his uh, wrist re-x-rayed and uh, see, see, the, really is. Yeah, see, see how things are going. He broke it a week ago, exactly, Monday, and uh, he has to see the fracture clinic and talk to the uh, guys there and uh, get a better outlook on how long to recover. <laughs> so uh, yeah. We are headed into North Bay and we are going to do some thrifting. Yeah, it's Monday, so it's baking, cooking, or thrifting. And today it's thrifting, guys. Uh, we're going to go to uh, Hawk Exchange. We're going to go to Value Village and see what kind of deals we can get. The last deal I got at Value Village was a Roots leather purse with the discount for senior day was six dollars guys for real leather i couldn't believe it <laughs> anyway that's where we're going we're on the highway right now i have to do all the driving because we run a stick shift car and he broke his right wrist so he can't shift he can't do anything so Anyway, um, so that's what we're doing and we'll uh, catch you up when we hit the stores. Hawk Exchange. Yeah. You can thrift in a pawn store. Depends what you're looking for. $22 movies for 10 bucks. 50 cents a movie? I can deal with that. Hubby's looking for new toys. Let's see what we can get. Size. They're called size. Yeah. Partial arch toy. And the knife cabinet. Whoa. One or two. Yeah. Yeah, I got a baby set in the bigger side. So you need the bigger ones. Yeah. Adults. Ooh, they look octagonal too. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are kids. <laughs> this is what we're looking for. Ooh, seventy dollars. No. I get them for thirty on Amazon. It's a little too much. Yeah. Thanks anyway. Check here first. <laughs> yeah. I looked. Because they're on local, Amazon. right? You want them right local. Amazon. Amazon starts them out with hex handles for thirty bucks. Yeah. So unless they actually have that U.S. branded blade name on them, they're the cheaper ones. So. Okay, so I have to order those. Yeah. yeah that's the baby stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Need the big boys. Do you have a magnet? Yep. 
girl. Toys. <laughs> oh, not not on the table. Uh, yeah, no, they might use those on the Nah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you piss off a woman, you never know what to do. Hey! Good you know that, but... <laughs> Ooh, my pretties. I love jewelry. Gotta look at the jewelry. Wow! Okay, here we are guys, Value Village. Time to go check out some deals, if there are any. There's no guarantee, so sometimes we come out empty-handed. You can never tell. I always stop here first. See if there are any deals in the mug section. I'm a coffee fanatic, so I have to see. Stay humble and kind. Good, good theory to run by. Here's another one. I'm not bossy, I just have better ideas. <laughs> Train your mind to see the good in every situation. Nice. Size matters. Yeah, I've tried these before. It takes about half a pot, and by the time you get to the bottom, it's gold. Ha! <laughs> For Gabby. Click free. What is that? 500 gig external hard drive. Oh! How much? Eight bucks? And it hasn't even been touched yet inside. Nice. It's easier. Nice! See, there's a deal. Right, yeah. I found a sign for my kitchen. 25 cents fresh brewed coffee served here. Have a cup. Yep. Yeah. Two ninety nine. Hmm. Do I have a room for that in my kitchen? I'll see. I think about that one. Tin. Oh, this is cute. Cat and a mouse. <laughs> it's a whistling kettle. I think. Yeah, looks like it. But the uh, Pampered Chef version, much better. Let's see what's in my next section.
bundle. And there's no rhyme or reason the way they put these together. It's just, okay, grab a stuff that fits in this bag and that's the price. $3.99. This looks like scraps, small pieces. And somebody's clearing out their closets and that's what they have left. $4.99. All the fall colors. Browns, golds. I'm going to be making purses and stuff, but I have lots of materials at home for that so far. Those are all golds. These are heavier fabrics. That might be good for purses. Ooh. For the umbrella side. <gasps> yes, $3.99. And the battery's out the back. Nice, and so we can sit under there at night. Yeah, and it's got a, oh, where did it go? It cranks it shut No, 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 it's, okay, right here. Splits open. You push that in, it splits and open. It splits so open so you can put it around put the pole. Put it on the you pole, don't have take to... it off so it's not left out in the bad weather. Nice. So I'm gonna sit like that, it gives you light. Nice. Oh. Four dollar. Cool. Four dollar. Just need your own bloody batteries. <laughs> but they're all cob lights. That's cool. And a gripper to hold it to the pole. Nice. That'll go nicely with the pole. The umbrella we got for ten dollars here the other day. Wow. Score. Okay. Alright, $4. $5. These are heavier fabrics, I think. If I can do it, I'm going to get these to make purses out of. We can do a craft, guys. That's on Fridays. Hobbies, crafts, music. I know I still have to play electric guitar for you. Okay guys, we're back home now and uh, I want to thank you for coming along on our trip today. Uh, first to the hospital, then to um, Hawk Exchange and Value Village. We made a few stops in between but I didn't want to make this video too long and I thought that the places I did show you uh, would be of interest on thrifting. So. Um, anyway, for a quick sum up, uh, we did come home with the umbrella light. It takes four, uh, double A's in the bottom. And, um, as we showed you there, it clicks open so you can put it around the pole with the lights facing down, of course. And you can light up your patio table at night under the umbrella. Uh, be sure to have citronella candles burning. Uh, <laughs> if you're planning on spending some time outside at night, this time of year at least. Um, but that was an excellent deal for $4. Like, really. Those are uh, really bright lights and uh, yeah. Can enjoy some backyard barbecue stuff. Anyway, uh, hubby did get this click free C2 um, 500 gig or half a terabyte um, portable uh, drive. And he's had some issues with formatting it, but I think we're figuring it out. Um, so for $8, half a terabyte is nothing to sneeze at really. Um, and it gives you the ability to offline storage your, your documents and photos and things you don't want to lose in case something happens to your computer. So that was a deal. Um, I did 
did manage to get this bag of material that I was talking about for $4.99 and uh, I thought now that we're home I'll open it up and kind of explore a little on what we got here. Now this is some, it's almost upholstery fabric that it's here and um, that's a stiffer fabric so it's going to be sturdy for things like purses and tote bags and things that you need um, to hold some weight. I uh, got a couple of holes in that one but you could place it, you know, um, so it doesn't wreck your design, I guess. Um, a bit bigger piece here, different designs. It looks like um, these are very more custom furniture. It is furniture fabric. Um, so there's some, some nice pieces here and uh, lots to use on a project or two. Perhaps if you wanted to do your own throw cushion or whatnot. Um, Brunetti Furniture Ink. Um, there's, it's like samples almost. I don't know where these came from, but somebody had samples, I guess. And they do have these holes through them. So I think these were from a sample book. So if you were going to get furniture made up, you could um, file through these samples and choose your pattern of fabric for your furniture. Um, but either way, this is kind of interesting. There's some, some neat patterns here. Um, flowers and, you know, whatnot. Um, there's, there's a lot you could do with these, like I said. Um, tote bags, little purses, um, cushions. Um, you could uh, maybe line uh, a chest or something with fabric and give it a little bit different finish to it. I'm thinking, yes, this is from a book. They're all similar holes in them, so it's, it's something that's um, wow, that's uh, significant throughout the whole batch of them. So, deal and a half, guys. And I did manage to pick up one more thing that I didn't show you. It was on the way out. And I didn't, uh, didn't have my camera handy at that point in time. My arms were kind of full. Um, but I got these little bags. They're just like um, like a silky uh, zippered pouch. The kind you put in like um, your suitcase to hold your makeup and stuff in. You, you can do all kinds of things with these. Um, I can use them as patterns to make my own little zippered pouches. Um, just take the dimensions and uh, deconstruct them as to how they sewn them and which steps to use to, to recreate these. Um, but yeah, these were um, really cheap. These were like two of them are tied together for two bucks. So a buck each. Hey, you can't miss on that. And one has the zipper across the top and one has it across like partway down the front. So um, yeah, these are handy even in your purse. If you want to keep your gum and um, lip gloss and things like that, smaller items, um, easy to locate, you put them all in a pouch like this and throw it in your bag. And you have them, if you want something small, you just grab this and then open it. And you know all your small stuff is in there. You're not hunting through the bottom of your purse. <laughs> Um, anyway, so thanks again for uh, coming along with us on our journeys today into um, the city of North Bay. And uh, 
Hope you enjoyed this new vlog style. Um, Wednesday, I am thinking of doing uh, a video on my Mac Mini. I've been running it for a while now, and uh, I want to show you how I'm using it and uh, whether the RAM and the hard drive space I've got that I ordered it with, if is that enough? Uh, how am I using it? You know, what, what kind of programs do I have on it? How is it working for me and for my purposes? Anyway, something to look forward to for Wednesday. Thanks again, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.